In this video, we will go over URL categorization filtering. So let's get started. To get there, you go to Plans, Protection Plan, and either select a plan created already or create a plan and then go to URL filtering. In another video, we discuss features around URL filtering functionality outside of categorization. Feel free to search in our YouTube channel for this other video. At this time, we have 44 website categories where you can configure access and either allow access to that category or deny access to websites in that category. By default, all categories are allowed. This will scan all web traffic related to categories where access you desire to be prohibited or allowed. Both the HTTP and HTTPS connections will be checked. In the checkbox, show all notifications for blocked URLs by categories. If you enable this, you will get all notifications shown in the tray for blocked URLs by categories. If a website has several subdomains, then the system will also generate notifications for them. Keep in mind, the number of notifications may be big. To the right of each category, there is an information icon, so a definition of what is in that category is listed. You can also type in the search to help find a category. As stated in the other video, exclusions will allow you to have URLs that are known to be safe to be added to a list of trusted URLs. If a URL poses a threat, this should be added to the list of blocked URLs. You would add a domain. All addresses from that domain will be treated as trusted or blocked depending on what you chose. This will also include any subdomains associated with that domain. Thanks for watching.